After facing heavy criticism about a lack of diversity at the top of the NYPD, changes were evident today. CBS2 political reporter Marcia Kramer has more. First came the photo op, the mayor and his new police commissioner, Dermot Shea, meeting with neighborhood policing cops in the Bronx. Then the press conference to introduce the new leadership team, laced with references to the neighborhood the Yankees call home. You know, at this time of year in this area, in 44th Precinct in this part of the Bronx, anytime you were normally here in December for a press conference, it's usually a free agent pitcher signing at <laughs> Yankee Stadium. But a different draft picks today, two new free agent pickups. <laughs> the police commissioner referring to his decision to name Rodney Harrison to succeed him as chief of detectives, the first African-American to serve in the post, and Fostos Pichardo as the new chief of patrol. He's the first Dominican in that job. Mayor de Blasio happy to take a victory lap on the appointments. This is a, a moment to celebrate and it's a moment to recognize as real progress and change at the NYPD. The mayor relishing the moment because he had taken heat for picking shade to lead the department, skipping over first deputy commissioner Ben Tucker, who openly admitted he was disappointed not to get the top job. The new chief of patrol broke the place up when he admitted he was stunned to get the job. Yeah, I'm speechless. Fausto is <laughs> lying to you, everybody. He's rarely speechless. It's remarkable, both uh, personally and certainly professionally. Uh, where I came from, I was born in the Dominican Republic and came here at an early age. Just a kid from the Lower East Side. I'm humbled. Uh, I'm very grateful, but I'm also excited. Um, it's bittersweet. Uh, I loved being the chief of patrol. Uh, we did some great things. The, the chief of detectives is something that I always had a passion about. The mayor and police commissioner promised more leadership changes to come and greater diversity for the department. In the Bronx, I'm Marcia Kramer, CBS 2 News.